The reduction of waste is nowadays one of the priorities to deal with. The invasion of packaging in the culture of disposable materials and the new rhythms of life brought a catastrophic increase of garbage. In addition to these problems, there are the difficulties and the costs of disposal that are constantly increasing. The only solution to this problem is to invert trends and attitudes, reducing the quantity of waste at its origin, buying intelligently and applying some simple changes in our everyday life. Plastic Food is a project by Monsignori Pierluigi, stage name Pozzi. The idea was developed in 2010, beginning with the installation of Land Art, a contemporary art form defined by the direct intervention of the artist in the natural territory, especially in pristine spaces like deserts, fields and pastures. He uses plastic materials, developing them as a concrete project of social and environmental communication. Pozzi uses plastic waste to create insulation in various different places, from the land to the city, until reaching Parc de Forest in Bruxelles. Plastic Food Project means to divulgate a very simple message, to reduce the production of garbage, communicating directly with people, including them in an emotional way. Plastic Food Project is a campaign of communication for a world with less waste. It has the goal to spread the message across the entire globe. We want to give our contribution. People are baffled when coming into contact with something that the day before was in the trash can and they totally forgot about it. The installation was in Bruxelles, London, Centre of Contemporary Art, Luigi Pecci in Prato, and numerous other cities in Italy, and one eco press is shown permanently at the Museum of Contemporary Art in Baia, Brazil. Since 2010, um, the project has been participating every year to the European Week for Waste Reduction. In 2011, the installation has shown the Parc de Forest, Bruxelles, and this year our high school is also participating. Sono Pierluigi Monsignori Pozzi, mi occupo da oltre dieci anni di installazioni di Land Art e questa che vedete alle mie spalle è il progetto Plastic Food. Il progetto Plastic Food è stato esposto al Centro per Arte Contemporanea Pecci di Prato, è in mostra permanente al Museo d'Arte a Bruxelles per l'Europa e Week Waste Reduction. E Plastic Food nasce dall'idea di riuscire a portare a una riduzione della produzione dei rifiuti. Noi dobbiamo avere la consapevolezza che ognuno di noi produce circa 200-250 kg di rifiuti plastici all'anno. Ora eh, siamo tutti concordi che non vogliamo discariche, non vogliamo inceneritori. E dove li mettiamo questi rifiuti? Quindi è secondo me importante reimpostare il nostro stile di vita, reimpostare il nostro, il nostro concetto di consumo. Se non vogliamo queste presse, queste ecopresse di rifiuti nel giardino di casa nostra, dobbiamo assolutamente reimpostare il concetto di chi produce e chi consuma in, una, in un sillogismo che dia come risultato il rispetto per l'ambiente. Noi oggi siamo davanti ad un'Europa che è in crisi, ad un intero pianeta che vive una crisi senza precedenti e non ci possiamo più permettere di comprare degli oggetti per poi gettarli via, quindi di avere un packaging che sia più sostenibile per l'ambiente e che abbia un impatto ambientale pari a zero. Ritengo che sia opportuno lasciare in eredità ai nostri figli un ambiente migliore e dobbiamo cambiare atteggiamento sui rifiuti. La terra è un enorme condominio dove ogni nazione ha le chiavi del proprio appartamento e dove ognuno può produrre energia come meglio crede. L'importante è che quel produrre energia come meglio crede non vada a danneggiare l'appartamento del vicino. Quindi dovremo incominciare ad avere una ecoconsapevolezza a livello mondiale completamente diversa. Eh, trovo inutile fare un referendum in Italia che riguarda il nucleare perché dovremmo farlo a livello europeo, se non a livello mondiale. Various artists follow plastic food project and they have uh, contributed with their works in different forms of art painting, sculpture, video, photography, poetry, music and figurative art.
The European Week for Waste Reduction will take place from the 22nd to the 30th of November 2014. The event is part of an environmental communication campaign to spread awareness and sensibility toward the use of environmental resources. The true goal is reducing garbage production, not only by recycling everything correctly. The main theme will be the battle against food waste. The three proposals of the European Week. Reduction. Strict reduction from the source. The urgency is to reduce the quantity of waste that we produce, giving tips to avoid a decrease and decrease the production of waste from the source. For example, the home composting, the use of stickers for no advertisement in our post box or choosing to drink water from the sink. It also covers actions that want to modify the attitude of the consumer, promoting the inclusion of aspects of sustainability when purchasing items, for example, choosing products with the label ECO or products that have less if none packaging, buying in an ethical way, purchasing groups and choosing immaterial presents. Reuse and preparing for reuse. Products can have a second life, repairing or reusing them instead of buying new ones, encouraging the donation of products that we no longer need. The proposal also includes action to modify the attitudes of consumer, buying reusable products or renting them instead of buying them. Recycle recycling, helping people to improve their attitude towards recycling, explaining for example how to close the circle of material resources, encouraging people to throw their garbage in the correct trash can, or organizing visits to the recycling systems. Green and I was here to my girl. Now get me money or say What do you know? Will everything about the story tell my Oh, oh.